is a British actress, model, and activist who rose to fame as Hermione Granger in the Harry Potter film series. From an early age, Emma was passionate about acting, and she worked hard to achieve her dreams of becoming a successful actress. In this video, we will discuss Emma's journey to the top of the film industry and the hard times she faced along the way. Emma Watson was born on April 15, 1990, in Paris, France. She grew up in Oxfordshire, England, and from an early age, she showed a keen interest in acting. Emma's parents enrolled her in a theater school at the age of six, where she honed her acting skills and gained experience on stage. In 1999, when Emma was just nine years old, she was cast as Hermione Granger in the first Harry Potter film, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. The film was a massive success, and Emma quickly became a household name. She went on to star in all eight Harry Potter films, which were released between 2001 and 2011. Despite her early success, Emma faced several challenges as she transitioned from child star to adult actress. In an interview with Vogue, Emma revealed that she struggled with anxiety and imposter syndrome as she took on new roles and tried to establish herself in the film industry. In 2012, Emma took a break from acting to attend college at Brown University in Rhode Island. She continued to act during her time in college, starring in films such as The Perks of Being a Wallflower and This is the End. However, Emma also focused on her education and graduated with a degree in English literature in 2014. After graduating from college, Emma returned to acting full-time. She starred in several successful films, including Beauty and the Beast, Little Women, and The Circle. She also became a vocal advocate for women's rights and was appointed as a UN Women Goodwill Ambassador in 2014. Despite her success, Emma faced criticism and backlash for some of her activism work. In 2017, she faced backlash for a photoshoot she did for Vanity Fair, in which she posed partially topless. Some critics accused her of being a hypocrite, given her advocacy work for women's rights. Emma responded to the criticism by stating that feminism is about giving women the freedom to make their own choices, and that her photoshoot was a form of artistic expression. In addition to her work in film and activism, Emma has also faced personal challenges in her life. In 2015, her private photos were stolen and leaked online, which was a traumatic experience for her. She also revealed in a 2019 interview with British Vogue that she was very stressed and not very happy during her early 20s, as she struggled to find her place in the world. Despite these challenges, Emma has continued to thrive in both her personal and professional life. She married businessman Leo Robin Tun in 2021 and has continued to work in film and advocate for women's rights. She is a role model for many young women around the world and is an inspiration for anyone who wants to pursue their dreams. In conclusion, Emma Watson's journey to the top of the film industry has not been without its challenges. She faced criticism and backlash for her activism work, and she struggled with anxiety and personal challenges. However, Emma has persevered and has become a successful actress, model, and activist who is an inspiration to many.